Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you all doing? Can you okay? Welcome to this joint uh, Lancet ELT Island event for ELT managers. Is everyone a manager? More or less, more or less. Well, welcome anyway. Great to see you. A few thank yous first of all uh, before, we get, before we kick off. Um, let me introduce myself as well. My name is Josh Round. I'm the uh, Director of Studies at St. Giles International in London. But I'm here today um, uh, representing LAMSIG, which is the Leadership and Management SIG uh, at ITEFL. Um, so, thank you for coming. Thank you very much, first of all, to um, Lou McLaughlin and uh, ELT Island. Great to be doing an event here in Dublin with them and sort of uh, being part of the scene and the, the burgeoning scene here. Um, thanks as well very much to Jerk Evan and Atlantic Language School for hosting this event. Very well. uh, fantastic facility, so great, perfect. Brilliant. Many, many thanks indeed. And also thanks as well to the speakers who've all uh, invested time and, and effort to put things together for us today and for coming all the way here, so thank you to them. And thank you for you guys to, for giving up your Saturday <coughs> and being here. Um, just a quick uh, word about LAMSIG. LAMSIG is the... Uh, the home, we hope, for people like you um, who want to sort of be part of ITEF or be part of uh, the, the international scene of ELT management. Um, we have obviously every year a PCE, a pre-conference event. Um, last, well this year in fact, um, back in April we had a fantastic day. The theme was uh, difficult, managing difficult conversations, difficult people and difficult situations. We, we had case studies and it was a really, uh, really productive day which had a lot of participation. Um, I remember Fiona was then possibly one or two others. Um, and of course we have a, a SIG track day at the conference um, as well. And, and, and this year we had some fantastic speakers, Duncan Ford, Maureen was speaking, Fiona Dunlop, uh, Dermot Fogarty and, and others. And it's a day really for managers to really, really uh, get a lot out of uh, um, some CBD. So that's a, that's a bit on Lansing. Um, I'm going to hand over to Lou. Say a couple of words. Yeah, um, just wanted to welcome everybody as well. Um, ELT Ireland are really happy to start focusing on a network of managers here and build it up. <coughs> Over the last two years, we've been building up a network of teachers through different events, um, different forums, and working on that. But now it's time to also look after ourselves um, as managers and build that up too. So this is the first um, we started in the summer, the first joint event that we've done for managers. And I think it's just going to be a cosier start, um, which is good because it'll give us a bit more of a chance to actually talk through the different issues and areas and things like that. Um, I just wanted to say also the other members of the committee, in case you want to speak to any of us throughout the day, or Peter here. Um, is he tweeting? Um, with the hashtag is at the back if you want to use it with your tweets throughout the day. And also Joanne at the back who lets after our communications. So if you have any questions for any of us, just please give us give us a shout. Thank you very much. Uh, I also need to mention Cambridge English. Um, Michael Carey is here uh, representing them along with uh, Connor, who's there. Um, so thanks very much to Cambridge English who are also sponsoring and, and helping us provide some uh, lunch and coffee later on today, so thanks very much for that. Um, so it leaves me, that, that, that's I think more or less it, to, to, to introduce... Yeah, oh yes, Joe was going to say something. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, I'm not going to keep you too long, it's just I'd like to say one or two things and then some practical stuff. Atlantic Language are delighted to be able to give the space over to a group that's doing such wonderful work. Equally, it's lovely to come down a lane in Dublin and not be in a hotel and be in an actual language school. From my point of view, so that I can get an awful lot out of today, we're in a very lucky position that Tom has travelled from our school in Galway. So I just want to say thank you to him because he's doing such an, a huge amount of work in relation to the IT and different things. It means that I can get an awful lot out of today, so I really do appreciate that and thanks to Tom. Equally, the Director of Studies, Anne-Marie, from on site here, is also going to be presenting, and that to me is really important, that people are getting involved. It's not just about us, the school, providing the space, it's that <coughs> I'm here, I'm enjoying it, I'm getting a huge amount of effort, Anne-Marie is presenting. To me, that's really, really vital that everybody starts getting involved and sharing information. We're a small industry, and the more we talk, the better. Practical stuff, straight through the double doors, obviously the lifts we won't use in an event of a fire. The, straight to the right, the stairs go straight down, the fire exit to the front, the doors are on a release button, you've all seen that as you've arrived in, okay? If anybody has any questions throughout the day, please come to me if I can give you any practical advice on anything, and we'll throw the Wi-Fi password up for the break times. 
just so that we feel a bit detached from the conference event, we're going to go up to the third floor for coffees and for lunch. Just so it might be more conducive to a bit more relaxation and more comfortable chat. So the food will be laid out in the breakout space and there's a couple of classrooms just to be able to go into and relax. Okay? And you're all really welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, anything else? Um, I suppose the other thing to say is obviously we've got this room and then the other, uh, the other sessions when we have concurrent ones are just along um, uh, down there. Um, 